like another exercise. And, and Rich, this isn't hard. I do this with people that have never had any acting in experience. I mean, a therapist could learn to teach their clients, like taking mm -hmm. one workshop or doing anything to to just in the office walk around and play with these expressions of selves. Uh -huh. And um, I see it with people that have never done anything. And all of a sudden, they're walking with their chin out and discovering, or they're able to assert themselves just from focusing on a certain... And they've never done that before. It's just... You're just setting the permission, given permission, because you're accessing through the body first. Yeah. Um, the other thing is emotion. Sometimes I'll have people get into a state of emotion. Each each one of these characters have an emotional center, or, mm. or you know. So what is the emotion? Not that it doesn't change throughout the play when I'm writing a play, but like to really get myself in an emotional state of love or hate, the two extremes, right? And have somebody walk around the office, or what I do in in my workshops is have I hate. I hate, so I get the whole body with I hate, and then I'll just lay a word on top of that. Once I see that they're really in their body, in that emotion, then I'll throw a word like dating or family dinners. Uh -huh. And then what comes off, they don't have to have any, what rolls out is a beautiful piece of art, an expression of things that took them by surprise that they never knew were, was inside of them because they've let go of the mind, they've dropped the mind, they're in their body, they're in that emotion, I've dropped a word on top, and boom, they're off and running. Yeah, yeah. It's beautiful.